what's up guys just in here of yuka tech and with the community quarantine going on i know that most of our hands are perpetually glued to our gadgets especially on our smartphones and while we habitually sanitize our hands we often overlook to clean our devices which by now is probably filled with gunk that can't be seen with the naked eye so together let's clean them with things you can find at home Starting with screen cleaning, I'm talking about your smartphone, tablet, and monitor. These are probably the easiest to clean as there are not many ports to scrutinize on. There are a lot of screen cleaning kit that is available in the market, but since we prefer not to buy one outside, here's an alternative. You'll be needing a lint-free microfiber cloth, but if you don't have one, you may opt for a clean cotton cloth, a half cup isopropyl alcohol, some cotton buds, and an empty spray bottle. Make sure it's clean. Before we start, just a reminder that you should never use your alcohol to clean your phone. Okay, so the first thing you have to do is mix the half cup distilled water with the half cup isopropyl alcohol. This will be our cleaning agent on most gadgets, so we'll name it Walcohol. That sounds good, right? Now spray the alcohol on the microfiber cloth or your cotton cloth. Do not oversaturate the cloth. Then wipe the front and back of your device. For small areas such as the camera lens, ports, speaker, clean them using the cotton buds. You can also use alcohol solution to clean the case for these devices. But if you don't have any alcohol right now, you can use antibacterial wet wipes in the meantime. Just make sure that they're not too wet. Let's move on to your laptop, keyboard, and mouse. For cleaning your laptop screen and exterior, you may also follow the first step. But with the addition of the keyboard and a mouse, you'll be needing some extras such as a small brush, an air pump if you have one, some q-tips, and a piece of clear tape. So make sure first that your gadgets are unplugged. Duh. Anyways, for your keyboard, start by brushing it or using an air pump if you have one. If you have a detachable keyboard, simply flip it and give it a light shake to get rid of any debris. Now use cotton buds or clear tape to go in deeper. Tear off at least an inch of tape and fold it in half, making sure that sticky sides are facing outward. Insert the tape underneath the edges of the keys and rub it back and forth a few times. If for some reason you also have something like this jelly dust remover for keyboards, you can use that too. Then use the brush to remove the bits and pieces of dirt. And lastly, wipe the entire keyboard using the microfiber or cotton cloth with alcohol. For disinfecting your mouse and trackpad, use a toothpick or a q-tip to remove gunks on the crevices of the mouse's body, especially on the scrolling wheel. For the sensor underneath, wipe it using the microfiber or cotton cloth or swab it gently using a q-tip. Then wipe the exterior of the mouse using the microfiber or cotton cloth with alcohol for the last touch. Then there's your desk. Of course, it's essential to disinfect your desk because it's not only where we work, but it's where we place most of our gadgets. Okay, so for this, you'll be needing a half cup of detergent, a cup of water, two cotton cloth, that's one for the wet and one for the dry, disinfectant wipes, and a bowl. Now make sure to get rid of all the stuff that's on your desk. Then with a dry cloth, give the desk an initial wipe. In an empty bowl, dissolve the detergent, give it a good stir, and dip the cloth. Wring the cloth and start wiping it on the desk. Using the same cloth, rewash it to remove any detergent residue, then use it to remove the residue on the desk. After that, you can wait for the desk to get dry, or you can wipe it using a dry cloth. Lastly, don't forget to sanitize your earphones, earbuds, or headphones. We all know how disgusting it is to see earwax on our earbuds. And it can also be the reason why you're having a hard time listening to your favorite songs. So for this, you'll be needing isopropyl alcohol, dishwashing liquid, some q-tips, microfiber or cotton cloth, a bowl, and disinfectant wipes. Alright, first remove the silicone tips of your earbuds. In a bowl, dissolve the dishwashing liquid in lukewarm water and submerge the tips and soak it for about 30 minutes or so. Rinse it after and set it aside to dry. Now onto the earbuds. Dip the q-tip in alcohol and wipe the mesh with it to remove any earwax residue. Be sure not to make the q-tip very wet to avoid moisture going into the earbuds. Afterward, clean the cord with alcohol-dipped microfiber or cotton cloth. 
And there you go. Make sure to keep your gadgets clean all the time. If you have more tips, do let us know in the comments. And if you found this video helpful, we'd appreciate a like. Subscribe to our channel for more content. Hit that bell icon so you don't miss any future uploads. And be sure to visit yugatech.com for the latest tech news and reviews. Once again, this is Justin and don't forget to wash your hands and stay at home.